What a turnover. This guy is unbelievable. At the breakdown comes to you from Bath Rugby. Let's have a look at the contenders for Green Flag Forward of the Month. So it's time to talk about the prestigious Green Flag Forward of the Month award. Now it's not the end of the month yet, but I can give you a steer on some of the contenders for September's award. First one, James Haskell, WASP captain, 50 cap England international, massively stepping up in his new role at his club. Against Northampton last week, he wasn't just physical, he was monstrous. Along with Chris Bell in the centres, but we don't talk about centres, they absolutely bashed the big Northampton forward runners. At one point I saw Dylan Hartley, massive ball carrier, Northampton talisman, carry the ball in close to the touchline, straight into Haskell, tried to drop the shoulder and Haskell picked him up in the air and threw him into touch. Absolutely ragdolled, one of the strongest ball carriers in the country. So he's playing really, really well. At Saracens, a guy who's really stepped up is young second row George Cruz. With Steve Borthwick leaving Saracens, I really wondered who's going to fill that slot, who's going to take that mantle. And George Cruz might not be the spiritual leader of the club, that's Alistair Hargreaves. George Cruz, in rugby terms, is really stepping up. He's big, he's really mobile, he's destructive, and he's got a hell of an engine, a really natural mover for such a huge guy. Love watching him play. Now down at Exeter, I'm going to bracket two forwards again because I can, because I'm allowed. I want to talk about Thomas Waldrum, a new signing from Leicester Tigers. He's the guy, he's got a very high work rate, but he's the guy who can produce special moments. So two tries in his first game against London Welsh. Since then, he's made great carry after great carry. Doesn't look necessarily that athletic, but he's brilliant on his feet. Very, very skillful, a very intelligent rugby player. I also love watching my old mate from Bath here, Ryan Caldwell. A lot of injuries, hasn't played much the last two years. He's fully fit and he's back. And when he's on the field for Exeter, he's just relentlessly aggressive. And his number of involvements, his number of effective, aggressive involvements in a game is just astonishing for someone in the second row. So when it comes to October the 1st and you want to see who's won, head to Premiership Rugby's official YouTube channel to find out.